This Duanton dog crate was purchased with my own money, and this is my honest review. Here's a quick unboxing, just so you know what to expect when you purchase this item and receive it. This dog crate obviously comes in pieces, so everything seems to become nicely wrapped in plastic and protected. I really like that because it'll avoid scratching in route or, or any other minor damage, which nobody wants when they purchase something new, right? So anyway, once I get everything here unwrapped, I'll give you a closer look. These two panels here go on the opposite sides of each other. Here are some support beams. It comes with all the screws and tools that you need. Rather minimalistic instruction manual, top, bottom, and side panels here. Now let's put this bad boy together. Now, putting it together was fairly easy. You really all you need is one little Allen key that it comes with and just a little common sense. My wife, who's not very handy, uh, could easily have built this. So I would say this is a very beginner friendly project that almost anybody can do. And once you get everything screwed in by hand, I like to do that by hand at first and then use the little Allen key to tighten it afterwards, which will make things a little bit easier when you're trying to make things align properly. Next, we're gonna flip this bad boy over here and put the little mat that it comes with, little cushion, and uh, get a closer look here. So here's the finished product. It's really nice wood, guys. It has three graded sides and one solid back. The lock's a little bit tricky to figure out. You gotta slide them in and then flip it downward. But once you get the little technique going, it'll be easy. The mat has a little non-slip bottom, pretty minimalistic cushion, and over here you slide and flip down, slide and flip down. We're pretty happy with this purchase. We like how the color kind of flows with our bamboo flooring, and Mello really liked it. That's plenty of space, and I hope this video was helpful.